Hey everyone, G loves trains here and welcome to day 32 of my vlog series Exploring the Northwest by Train. Now throughout this series I've had a very common question asked and that is G loves trains, how are you going to do Denton and Reddish South? Well today, not only you but me as well, we're all going to find out the answer to that together. I am off to, hopefully, Reddish South, Denton, Guide Bridge, Hyde North, Hyde Central, Woodley, Romilly and Rose Hill. So just at Stockport, I'm off to platform 3A. Now this service is one of the parliamentary ones so there are two trains calling at the dodgy stations both on a Saturday. Now I could have come on like two separate days to hang around those stations but I thought it was probably best to just try and get them both done in one day whilst they're on the same line. So the best idea I came up with was let's just ask the conductor if it would be okay for me to step off and back onto the train. If they say yes, wonderful. If they say no, well, I'll be back here next week. The next stop is Reddish South. What a loud train, of course there is. 150, 136, and they said yes. Reddish South, it's one platform, Northern only trains. Does look like it used to be two though. Thank you. I did look, it takes about 25 minutes to walk from Reddish South to Reddish North. I highlighted off Reddish North in day 30. Getting up, 150, 136. And we're now at Denton, it's two platforms and a northern Italy station. Uh. Apparently we've got two minutes here. It's an island platform, there's some flowers and some stirs over there. Lovely, thank you. <laughs> we're back on, 150, 136. And what is your name? Peter. Peter. Peter's going to tell us how much fun riding trains is. So today I've got a Manchester Wayfarer ticket. Nice one. I went to Piccadilly, Staley Bridge, Stockport, Staley Bridge, Manchester Piccadilly, round the new line to Victoria, to the airport, Warrington, Victoria, Metrolink up to Bury to watch a couple of steam trains and then back home. That I'm sounds like very fun. Here. Yeah. You're never too old to have fun. Absolutely. Exactly what Peter says. It's a more complicated day than my one, that one. <laughs> Enjoy it anyway. Thanks. Lovely to meet you. Do you know what? That was really fun actually. <laughs> I'm a bit out of breath from jumping on and off. But um, yeah. That was a big help from the conductor just letting me do that actually. Right, I'm at Guide Bridge. It's an northern only station with two platforms. I'm just looking at those station selfies I've just taken of the last two stations and blimey. <laughs> the Denton ones just to, show, just to show you how blurry these are. I mean, what is that? <laughs> Bloody hell, I mean I've got one not blurry but I'm not even looking at camera, I'll have to do. <laughs> Who knew there was a depot here? was on the lookout for the Ashton Canal actually because I thought we could go have a walk along there considering I've got like 
an hour 20 odd minutes here which way to walk that's the question i think i'm going to go ahead of me here because of the creepy dark looking little tunnel Ooh, does this echo a little bit What train we're getting on. It's proud to be northern as well. 195, 116. There's we all over the floor and poo all in the toilet, do I see? It's not from me, I've not been yet. <laughs> Yeah, to be honest, I wasn't expecting a sexy 195 down this route. I thought it would be just another 150, really. I'm at Hyde North. There mustn't be a lot of people who get off and on the train here. I'm more than happy to spend an hour at this place. I did notice the waiting shelter here, which doesn't have a seat, but it does have CCTV. This is like one of the most hidden away entrances to a station ever. The entrance to Hyde North is here. Like you would not think it's down there, would you? I can also see another railway line right here. I'm thinking that's gonna go on to Hadfield or Glossop. The only thing that gives away there's a station down here are the Northern Coloured Lamp Posts. So Hyde North, it's got two platforms and Northern trains and the irony of life strikes again. It has been so hot and sunny lately, but as soon as I come out to film, the clouds are out and it's a little bit chilly and just as i'm saying this the sun is coming out right come on go on go on just having a walk over the bridge for the fun of it just notice that sign there different to the others I'm on 150, 111, it's connected to 150, 124 and I am glad I'm travelling up to Rose Hill Marple as opposed to travelling from it because probably with it being a Saturday the trains going to Manchester are very busy indeed. a very quick ride we're at Hyde Central it's an northern only station with two platforms and it's getting rather windy oh my days I smell garlic bread oh I love garlic bread this platform I don't know which number it is is a little bit more over that way versus our platform I'll be flipping out. Versus Hyde North, Hyde Central is definitely more modern. It's got the dot matrixes. And don't even ask me where Hyde South is. I've not a bloody clue. Does it even exist? <laughs> I just realised, by the way, that I had something stuck in my tooth. I've got it out now. Um, I'm going to go have a look at the Peak Forest Canal. Ta-da! Here I am. Not got long here, though, so I'm going to head back and get the train. Getting back on the beautiful 195 116.
I'm at Woodley, but is Woodley woody? The answer is yes. There are quite a few trees around and I was wondering where that track was leading to. I had a quick search and I'm still none the wiser. There's no stations down there or anything though. You'll find northern trains at Woodley, also two platforms. Very important to note these things guys. There's also a lovely station building here. We are starting with Romilly. Oh wow, so the station building is actually one, two, three, four houses. I'm on 150, 124, and I remember from before it's connected to 150, 111. I might just have a quick wee before we get to Romilly. And here I am. I must say, Romilly does remind me of Breadbury, but this station has got red seats and a signal box. When you're at Romilly, you put your knickers on your head, you put your knickers on your head, you put your knickers on your head. When you're at Romilly, you put your knickers on your head and you shout, Squishy Bye Bye! I'm so glad the sun's come out now, it's getting really warm. This is what I was after. But Romilly is actually quite a busy station on the Hope Valley line. It sees Northern trains and it's got two platforms. It is a beautiful station this one. Quite a few services come through here as well. You've got your Sheffield, New Mill Central and the one we're on, Rose Hill Marple. This piece of artwork's really cool. I didn't realise at first, but it's actually made out of bottle tops. It's actually gone cooler again now and super windy, but the next train is incoming. And at a guess, I don't even need to look at this train to know what it is. 195. 116, let's see. Yep, it is. And I'll tell you something, I am proud to be Northern. I've got five minutes of a back massage now. And the views are very leafy at the moment. And oh, look, there's a Blackpool Tower going up. That was the marple aqueduct we just passed. Absolutely beautiful. I'm at Rose Hill, full name Rose Hill Marple. Not to be confused with the beautiful marple. Not that this isn't beautiful because it certainly looks it. It's a Northern only station with one platform. Is that a buffer stop down there? Because even though this is a terminus, I did actually think that the line carried on. Obviously it doesn't. Rose Hill Marple is getting a big thumbs up for me. By far the prettiest station we've been to today. Mm -hmm. 
whilst it's gone sweltering again and not just that i mean i was gonna come here anyway but guess what i am back walking along the middlewood way do you remember back in day 18 when i went to middlewood station and i was on here and after i uploaded that vlog i found out it's actually also a disused railway line <laughs> I wouldn't mind one day actually walking the entire length of this way right up to Macclesfield but I'm not going to do so today because I'm actually on a GM Day Ranger and after I finish here I do want to go and make the most of it. I am chuffed to get two more dodgy stations done and dusted. I did get off a train and onto a train so it worked out perfectly. Also, have you noticed my hair's been cut? Thank you very much for watching everyone. Bezzy bye!